On 12th August Friday, Asia's biggest compressed biogas plant has been commissioned in Sangpur district of Punjab. Normally in biogas, it contains methane and some other gases like hydrogen sulphide and carbon dioxide and water vapor. But in case of compressed biogas, it is purified to remove hydrogen sulphide, carbon dioxide and water vapor and then compressed. By doing it, the biogas become more eco-friendly and the amount of methane become more than 90%. Compressed biogas has calorific value similar to CNG and hence can be utilized as automotive fuel. Punjab New and Renewable Energy Source Minister Aman Arora said the plant with a total capacity of 33.23 ton compressed biogas per day had already been commissioned in April 2022. The plant has now started commercial production of compressed biogas which is supplied to Indian Oil Corporation Limited. With this, two more plants of total capacity of 14.25 ton compressed biogas are likely to be completed in 2022 to 2023 and remaining projects will be commissioned in next three years. The cabinet minister said these projects are expected to fetch investment of around Rs 12,000 crore, besides generating employment opportunities for 8,000 skilled and unskilled persons. Overall, the plant will consume about 16.5 lakh ton paddy straw per annum to produce 492.58 ton compressed biogas per day. And the organic manure will be used for organic farming which will help the local allied industries to flourish. All of us know that Punjab's farmers burn their crops residue in the field. But with the biogas plant, they don't need to burn the crop residues and it will give them a extra income to help their families and it will also reduce the pollution level. So that's all for today. Till then, goodbye.